God's sakes. to another red valkyrie presents i'm of course shay the red with my amazing co-host cyborg valkyrie how you doing Cy? i am doing awesome shay how are you i'm good i you know i'm getting really really good at drawing a triangle with an elongated tail yeah it's almost like we've done one of these uh streams uh within the last few weeks yeah and you know and then and then the con of course uh, yeah. Although at the con, I will say I was not responsible for my makeup. The amazing cat mouse uh, made sure to do the triangle for me. So I didn't fuck it up, basically. She was like, that you're representing cool. us. Let me draw this for you. That is kind. <laughs> you guys were so um, cool that weekend. It's amazing. It was, it, that was such a fun I weekend. I had to put it in the intro, right? I was like, we were uh -huh. on location streaming, even though, and I had to find the one time that we weren't potato cam, which was uh, actually really hard. Where were you? What on what? Where were you? Which con? We were at Tidewater. We we uh, yep. so I was I was at Tidewater Comic Con. So I was operating back here, so in in the interwebs to keep things going, and uh, we were on location attempting to stream wow. on terrible Wi-Fi in a convention center, <laughs> and it was uh it was a thing we did. <laughs> did it work? You know. Did it work? We made it work. Oh, I mean, Great. Yeah. No, we, it was good enough. People enjoyed it, even if they couldn't see it real well. Uh, was, <laughs> but we had, was, we had a ton of fun at the con. How, how big a convention is uh, Tidewater now? It's a good medium-sized convention now. It's actually pretty yeah. big. It takes up takes up a good two sections of the convention center now. Oh, that's yeah. great. Yeah, yeah, it's a, it's a pretty big show, and uh, they have. Uh, I see some of the guests that are popping in for for next year. I got to pop up the thing so I could. See who it is. Yeah, I, I remember seeing that the guest list was becoming quite impressive, which it usually is. So I'm just like, it, it's mean, a good yeah. show, and it's my local show. It's like, uh, that's 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 my homeboy show. So it's like, I, I have to do that one. Yeah. Yeah, can I ask uh, Shay and Sai where you're physically located? What state or area? Uh, so I'm I'm in Maryland, and I'm in Virginia. Yep. Oh, for okay. So, so like, all these neighbors, co all these coasters. <laughs> Yeah, except for you I, and me, for Steve. now. Except for know, right? Don and I, we're on the way. <laughs> Eureka and okay. LA. I, I'm from I used Utah, to live in Virginia. So. Now. I this is true. Yeah, how many how many years did we actually live in Virginia together, Don? Because that was like a good that was a good chapter like, in together in together. Uh, like like literally like house. like ten minutes apart. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, when, when so first like we shared a we shared a bunk bed. It was I was great. gonna say now I know why Don became a real <laughs> I, estate agent to get a house. I, I always, get, get, I always get, get the top bunk. I get the top bunk. That way, oh, Don no. can fax the the fax machine. <laughs> you never let the guy with the belly have the top bunk. You just get farts in your face all night. <laughs> oh, no. I didn't. I didn't have a belly back then. I had to work sure, on that. Sure. That's... <laughs> Yeah, yeah, my daughter. My daughter says I used yeah. to look like. Or I, I I look like what I used to look like back in the nineties. I, I look just like Logic, apparently, who is a, a popular oh. rapper. Apparently, yeah, that's, that's that's pretty true. Yeah, yeah. But see, I'm future Logic, so Logic can look at me and be depressed, and he's like, "You're gonna lose your hair, and you're gonna gain some weight." <laughs> <laughs> now I know why you always wear that hat. <laughs> I'm gonna send you a well, wig, Bill. <laughs> oh my god. She has lots uh, of hats. We do have, we uh, do have an I extensive should've... wig collection. I, 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 have... I, should, I should have an extension of Bill now. So I got the bald head. So I, I should have like the collection of uh, cyberpunk wigs to go yeah, along. Yeah. Actually, what I really want is like an Elvis wig. I think that would be dope. I've never had straight hair. Hey, but... There you go. I mean, we can... <laughs> Bill, Bill's Puerto Rican. A lot of people don't know that. Yeah, yeah, a lot of people don't. yeah, the guy with the German name is half or partially Irish 
and Puerto Rican. And then cat mouse is actually like half Puerto Rican and half Mexican with that, that little 5% of Irish in there somewhere. So, wow. Yeah. That is hilarious. It looks very fluent oh. in, in Spanish. He, he, oh, yeah. he helped the poor old lady in the airport figure out where to go one time. And yeah, you remember, oh, oh dude, remember you're a, that. dude, that's amazing. That was I like a we- very nice act of kindness, Bill. But I think you sent her to the wrong gate. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, I got her got her heading off to Paris or somewhere. And she's like, I just wanted to go home. <laughs> she's asking what where the, the baggage claim was. Where the what McDonald's the was in the terminal. <laughs> uh-huh. That gringo, he sent me to the wrong gate. <laughs> but yeah, Don oh, Don and I lived in Virginia. Uh, we moved. Don lived in Eureka. I lived in San Diego. And uh, when we co-founded uh, Entity Comics and when we were doing parody press and all that good stuff, we decided to move to a location that was, we kind of <laughs> talked each other into it. We moved all the way to Virginia Beach so that way our houses could be close enough together so that way we can actually get our work done more efficiently. Yeah. That way we can have our meeting, we can have get you know scripts approved. And Laura, I mean, she was amazing. She was actually printing out the films for printing. We had, and- yeah, we had a full-blown pre-press system in our in our house like with all the chemicals and uh, like a hundred thousand dollar system at the time which was pretty expensive well we were were pumping out zen comic books like nobody's business sometimes we would have two books in one month for a independent small independent uh, Mm. publisher we we did we did awesome oh we were we were we were on the radar we were we were making a Breaking our mark, That's yeah, the for sure. Thing though is like, it, I don't think that people realize that anytime you see people that are successful, they're always like, "Oh yeah, well, it's just because they're they've got this awesome talent, so of course they're successful." And it's like, do you have any idea how hard the hustle is? Like how the hustle, yeah, the exactly. The reason that people are successful is because they they are tenacious. Like, yeah. Don's yeah. like, you know what, pre-press, it would be really great if we could outsource this, but I don't trust people and I'm tired of waiting uh-huh. on them and I'm tired of the quality crap. And so, you know, what? I'm just going to do it myself. Okay. Cause if I do it, <laughs> I know it'll be good. Like yeah, it, there's so much that goes into it. Well, yeah, and there we're is. still doing it. I mean, you know, hence yeah. what we're doing even right now, you know, Zen mm-hmm. was created by uh, Dan Cody and myself in 1987. That's 37 years ago. And I was two. Every so often, <laughs> every so often, uh, uh, you, you have to reinvent yourself. And I had the mute so I could cough again. Sorry, guys. I, I, got, I got a light cold. <laughs> That's what these Kickstarters are, are all about. Is Zen has we've basically reinvented Zen about five times now over yep. the past thirty-seven years. And you got to do that, you know, if you're gonna yeah. if you're gonna have any currency in the marketplace. You gotta stay fresh. Yeah. Absolutely, absolutely. Well, uh, so for people who don't know why we're here, I, first off, if you don't know why we're here, we've, we're eight minutes into the stream. I, you probably yeah. should have read something by now. <laughs> uh, but we're here for a super awesome Kickstarter. Before we bring that up, I believe yeah. we have a cosplay reveal side. Yeah, I don't think <gasps> we've ever made it this far into a stream without the cosplay reveal. I don't think reveal. we have either. That's crazy. I love it though. I lo- I just love the natural banter. Make sure that we're not going to cut off your head because everyone's above you now. It'll be I know, fine. right? It's like... it, it'll be fine. I don't care. Duck down, you tall bitch. Oh, <laughs> this is this is is oh. Ow! <laughs> Shay the Red has now become awesome. Oh. <laughs> See? Told you. Uh, yeah. Here wow. X. I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna lie. I was very close to doing Zen because I was like, I've, I've done Nira X there a couple that times. Is... Uh-huh, so uh-huh. like, let me, let me maybe do Zen. And then I looked at it. And I was like, oh, bald cap. I'd have to get like muscles somewhere. <laughs> and and blue, blue, blue face yeah. paint like the Blue Man Group. Look, I, <laughs> I'm not. I'm not opposed to face paint. I'm not opposed to putting in the work. And the next time we have you on, I will be Zen. However, sweet, awesome. It's also a Thursday, and I have to work tomorrow, and that's a lot of blue <laughs> to try to wash out before that's a I lot have of to blue. work and be yeah. professional. You want to so... hear? You want to hear an interesting story? I, I don't know how these launch parties go, but you want to hear a slightly interesting story about uh, the blue man group and, and Zen. Oh my gosh, please, yes. Yes, since I saw him live in Vegas. 
So, so here's the deal. Uh, so Zen, I create with Dan in no. We publish Zen number one in November 1987, right? Mm -hmm. And after a while, uh, we hear about this thing, the Blue Man Group, that is blowing up big time in Vegas, right? And we look at them and say, "Why well, these guys are all blue? They, they must." They must have ripped us off. They must have gotten their idea, their inspiration from Zen. So I did a lot of research, and guess what? The first appearance of the Blue Man Group in Las Vegas was two months before we launched our comic book. You see what happens? So they what did. So, yep. so I guess it was just in the zeitgeist, as they say. Hey, you know, there's. There's really good ideas tend to be cyclical and they kind of come around repeatedly. And so the fact that you were like, yeah, Zen's going to be like a blue alien. Um, and, you know, Blue Man Group was like, yeah, we're going to hit a bunch of drums and blue face paint. Like that just, yeah. blue just was the thing. That was, yeah. like, look, I got, we got the it, blue peep in the background. All right? There you blue go. Blue is a popular thing. <laughs> oh, it is. wait, if you just hold the blue peep, we've got our entire cast of our book. It's Zen and Mira yeah. together. It's Zen. Zen's there you go. We found Zen. Zen. We found it's Zen. Fine. That's what we He's perfect. Zen's, Zen's bulb. That's is what he, we call is he edible. Uh, <laughs> we we call Zen. that Z that color Zen blue. By the way, it's that's become kind of a thing because and it's a like, common you know, blue. <laughs> the blue color has been very very good to to us. By the way, I you know because I've been doing this damn thing so long, I have so many <laughs> freaking stories. I could talk for which you're not going to want me to do for over long <laughs> about zen stuff that people may or may not have ever heard so i'll just let you kind of lead the show and anytime you need me to just start yakking i can do it <laughs> i appreciate that i like how steve's like you don't know me yet Voluntary yakking. Talk. <laughs> that's fantastic uh so yes. for people who don't know yes. we have zen uh, Intergalactic Ninja Bounty Wars number one, which is where Zen and Nira X meet up and shit gets crazy and they got to figure out what the hell's going on if they're going to survive this uh, insane war that is kicked off, which yeah. is such a fun premise. And can I just say that the way that people have drawn Zen for a lot of the pinups and stuff that you have in here, I kind of am entirely in love with his almost kawaii eyes that are just yeah. huge and solid green. I was like, oh my, oh my gosh, he looks like a little chibi. <laughs> yeah, he's he does. so He looks like a pissed off chibi, but he looks like a chibi. So he's a chibi, that, but he's a that's ninja. All, that's and he's all, late on his bills. <laughs> that's all Bill's thing, you know, that's that's what Bill uh, brought among many things to, to Zen. And I think everybody knows that when Dan created the original iconic Zen, you know, Zen did not have much of a face. He only had those eyes. He did not have a nose, and he did not have a mouth. Uh, he doesn't need it. But he's he got them now. It. But he but he grew them. He grew them, uh, and it's explained how and why okay. that happened. And you know, it's explained in a book that Bill and I did many years ago called Zen Bounty Hunter. I mean, you know, here we go again. It's like there's just so many Zen stories. There's so much. But in the meantime, please support our Kickstarter and look for yes. that book later. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes, so, we appreciate uh, anyone's support in the uh, Kickstarter. And so far, so good, right? Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, you, guys, you guys are doing really good. And for anyone who's going to be like, well, it's supposed to be a launch party. You're supposed to launch light. Look, some people get real excited, okay? And things happen, and we just... Yep, I, I noticed that the button was hit. It. Yeah, I, know, I noticed that the button went, and I was just like, okay, I guess it's a top secret soft launch. So, yeah, but but here we are now. Yeah, exactly. This, this is what we're here Look, for. I see some good friends. Because you, you hmm? want to hear Shay and Cy bitch at each other. You want to see Shay in a cosplay. You want to hmm. hear the craziness that happens when we get yeah. Bill, Don, and Steve all together. This is the real comic life. This is like the, it's, for... it's like the thug life, but it's the comic life. I love it. <laughs> exactly. I love it. I see I see some person in the chat. How you doing, man? Pop XP, yeah. what's up? Nile, what's going on, man? Awesome. I'm so glad you're here, dude. We got, we got all kinds of great people. In I the see chat. that Don Chin is in the chat. Wait a minute, there's two Don Chins. I don't know who that is. That is <laughs> oh, okay, so so tell me tell me a little bit about Wait, this I'm in the chat too. Yeah. Series. 
uh, this, mm -hmm. this specific, like the first book that's kicking off this new series, whoever wants to talk, you want to Rochambeau? I don't know. Well, well, I'll say, I'll say that I'm very happy for, and this is one of the reasons I had to have Don on the show tonight, because we launched Zen, the very first Entity Comics book that we ever launched back in 93 was yeah. Zen issue zero. And that was the first appearance of Nira X. And uh, so that's, that's you know, this is like a nice full circle. Like this is this is like my Zen family uh, coming together, you know? So it's, it's, it's really cool to have this story, actually have this crossover with Nira and all these bounty hunters and all this cool stuff. But as far as uh, the story goes, I'll turn it over to Steve. Steve is the one writing this, uh, this uh, four issue miniseries. So I'm, I'm just over here making it look good and holding the camera. Right. Well, uh, it, it's a one hundred, it's a one hundred page story, uh, divided into like four, you know, twenty five page books. The first of which is the subject of the first uh, Kickstarter, mm -hmm. and th th this story is an exploration of what it means to be a bounty hunter. Uh, I've been a big fan of the bounty hunting genre for a very long time. So far that it goes back to when Steve McQueen was on television in a series called Wanted, Dead or Alive, and he was a bounty hunter. And this nice. show goes back so far that the show was in black and white. They didn't even have color TV yet, okay? Right, so, right, right. So bounty hunting had its start in the Old West. You know, in, you know, the bounty hunters were the guys who were pretty much enforcing the law. Um, and as time went by uh, and science fiction became a dominant genre, bounty mm -hmm. hunting fit right into it. And today, oh, you know, like the Mandalorian is a bounty hunter, mm -hmm. Boba Fett, bounty hunter. Mm -hmm. uh, dog. Uh, dog. Dog. And of course, dog. <laughs> dog. How can we forget it? So, so as, as I went along developing Zen as a bounty hunter, um, I studied and learned all about bounty hunting, how it works, the good, the good parts of it, the dark mm -hmm. underbelly of the uh, world. Okay, There's Steve the gets into the nitty gritty. <laughs> yeah, for example, I'll give you one thing. I, I, I warned you, Shay. I could just keep talking like forever here. It's like <laughs> verbal diarrhea. I'll interrupt you if I if you start talking about stuff I no longer care about. You're good. Keep going. This is interesting. <laughs> so. For, so for example, in, in the world of bounty hunting, there's a person known as a bounty killer, okay? Now these are the real bad, badasses of the business because the reason they're called bounty killers is regardless of whether their contract is dead or alive, they always kill the quarry. And the reason they get away with it is they always, when they bring the corpse in they say self-defense he was going to kill me okay of course so, so at the beginning what? at the beginning we, of this yes we got it we got to pay attention to like one very important thing about bounty hunters right yeah to include like historic yeah. bounty hunters current bounty hunters right. like dog the bounty like come on like all these bounty hunters that exist whether it's fiction or non-fiction Right. It doesn't necessarily draw the most straight-laced crowd. It it draws a lot of people who really like to blur that, you know, mm, it's that a, it's slightly, line. It's slightly exotic, slightly more Absolutely. colorful crowd. Absolutely. Maybe not, Play with the rules maybe a little maybe bit. Maybe, <laughs> maybe like a little bit on the edge. But I, I do know, like... Just I, a I, little. Yeah, yeah I do well, like that. And anytime you have elements of like Old West kind of stuff, kind of like oh, yeah. bleeding into science fiction, that's always like a really cool mix, you know? Well, and yeah. As as a person who is like a huge freaking old Wild West fan, like I, yeah. I grew up in Utah, right? I grew up mm -hmm. in the Wild West. Yeah. Like, oh come on, it was Mormons. Stuff. You didn't have any killers. <laughs> For the Mormons, thank you. Okay. And there there was a lot of sal there's still saloons. You can actually uh -huh. go to parts of Utah and find yourself some yeah. old shanty towns and saloons and shit like that. Non alcoholic. Crazy. I, well, the old yeah. dual <laughs> saloon. I have, beer. I have some okay. root beer. I have a feeling <laughs> exactly. it's the root beer there. saloon. Sarsaparilla. <laughs> yeah. you, know, you know, these guys. You know, they're not. 
uh, government agents. They're not cops, all right? They're but they're outside they, the law. <laughs> they're outside the law, but they Little function bit. as like Little a quasi legal thing, and it, that's what's Little so bit. cool. That's what's so edgy about them, right? Oh yeah. So. So what happens, uh, just to give a little preview, uh, in the first issue, okay, of the series, uh, Zen encounters a bounty killer and some bad shit happens, okay? Some really bad shit happens. And it's so bad that Zen is, is wondering if he should remain in the profession, okay? And what happens is he, he consults with Master Sattva, you know, Master Sattva being the master of the planet Om who raised Zen, okay? Yeah, like and basically what, his mentor. His, he totally his mentor. Yeah. And um, what happens is uh, Master Sattva has a suggestion. Before you decide if you want to get out of the bounty hunting biz, go visit and meet and hang out with some of your fellow bounty hunters because Zen, you're a big loner. You don't do that right so zen takes him up on it he goes to a bounty hunting lodge right and meet and we meet a whole bunch of, of interesting unique bounty hunters including nira x who gets involved and what happens is uh, just to give a little more preface there's a there's a big war going on between two space lords okay two guys that want to control a big sector of space and Zen gets hired by one of the lords to take out or to capture the munitions dealer for the other, for the competing lord, right? And mm -hmm. what Zen doesn't know and what Nira doesn't know at that point is that there's like dozens of bounty hunters that are all conscripted to do this. So it's like bounty hunter against mm -hmm. bounty hunter. Hence it's like some the, John Wick shit going on. Yeah, it's right a lot of John Wick shit. <laughs> and, and hence the term. I'm going to retitle the book Lord. Zen Wick. Yeah. Zen so, Wick. There you go. I'm going to have a yeah. Zen That's, Wick. Hello, Mr. The Wick. Of the story and, uh, you know, these cool Zen year, coins. Right? I mean, I, right I really there. delved into it. And I, I just can't wait for this first book to come out. I know people are going to love it. Well, it, it sounds like a really fun premise. There are some amazing covers. Before we do all of that, Yes. Uh, I have to I have to verbally publicly thank Cricket Painter for uh their absolutely generous uh super chat. Thank you so much for the twenty five dollars. Thank you, you Crooked. Always awesome and appreciated. Awesome, this awesome. Cosplay is getting better by the minute. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I appreciate it. Look, the little the little shrug thing, it it's cute, but it's a little scratchy and it's kind of hot, and I don't want to wear it, so I take it off. <laughs> um, <laughs> but this is this is classic Nero. What are you it's talking better about? Better you wear awesome. it than Bill. I just went. I just want more classic and less like sci-fi for a second. It'll be fine. See, don't that, worry. That, that, that's why that's why Don is one of my oldest and closest friends. He tells me the truth. <laughs> Bill, don't wear the Nero X outfit. <laughs> yeah. Don always tells um, the truth. <laughs> also, I wanted I wanted to point this out where Don was talking about this variant cover. Can can we just can we just appreciate this for a second? Because oh my gosh, that is so dynamic, and isn't honestly, it? Honestly, yeah, and and you know what? I need to I need to point out something about uh, this is this is by artist Thad Rhodes. Okay. Uh, we were we're Thaddeus. able to bring him on. Yeah, Thaddeus, we're able to bring him onto the project um, because AI art has been around for about eight weeks and everybody's uh, doing prompts and things. I didn't want anybody to think that because this is this is like a a, a, a layered digital piece, but it's not an AI piece. No AI was used in the creation of you his art. You can tell because she's got the right number. They all have the yeah. right number of fingers for their characters. And yeah, and AI, AI doesn't know how many fingers Zen has, so he, he would have given him 12 fingers. Right? <laughs> it would all be messed up. Uh, so, but no, so yeah. I love the, the, it looks almost like an oil painting. Yeah. And yeah, it's got that, I'm, he has that movie poster kind of look to his yeah. stuff. And he's always very and much more realistic. I'm digging Mira. Like, so mm -hmm. you, Every time you see Nira, she's always a little cheesecake, a little bit homicidal, right? A little bit, Super little bit. adorable. Seeing her like this, I'm like, this is how, like, Nira in my dreams, that's what she's mm -hmm. actually like. Like, she there looks all go. cute and innocent, but this is when you, like, you have pissed her off. Good luck to you, yeah. sir. Now, you want to hear something about uh, Thad? Sure. Oh, no. Here a deep, do. dark secret. Thad Rhodes. So, years ago. 
years Thank you, Larry. ago, years ago, Thad did uh, an amazing illustration of Zen with a female character. It wasn't uh, wasn't uh, Nira at the time. It wasn't Nira at the so time. I was so impressed yeah. with it. I sent it to Heavy Metal Magazine, mm -hmm. and guess what? It appeared on the back cover of Heavy Metal Magazine. So Thad, wow. Wow. Thad is an awesome talent who has, oh, yeah, you know, for sure. who, who has been in many venues. He's also a, a very well-established, like, urban t-shirt artist whose work a lot of people wear. They just don't know it's by Thad. You know what? I feel like I need to have a conversation with Thad. You know me and merch, Bill. This is true. You know oh, yeah. Like with the merch. Don knows, too. Don, Don's seen all the merch I do. Yeah, I actually I have just a black now tiger. to show you. I have a yes. black tiger t-shirt. Oh, I, I should go change, change into that. I got to hear know, about this merch the, thing. I got the boob window. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, no, it's, it's so, Bill, I'll have to show you something that I that I made that you'll appreciate. It's an NF zip up hoodie. I'll, I'll show you. Uh -huh. um, but I love, I love the look of this. And I love that it's just, it's so layered, it's so dynamic. And yeah. while I get a lot of people would probably be like, oh, it looks like AI. Like, or is sometimes AI just really good at mimicking good artists? Look well, that's the thing. Good. AI is taking what artists have created. They, they, exactly. they scrape, they scrape the whole internet. That's the only real reason. Yeah. I mean, the, that's one of the two reasons that people are angry about AI is because they could have rolled it out a lot more ethically, a lot more like, not so, like I'm just gonna take your stuff without even acknowledging yeah, not, or not, not. So you should yeah. be happy that we're even. Yeah, using don't do stuff. what it I really. do with art and just you know Google search and find some cool shit and throw it up don't on our channel. <laughs> don't be shy. But AI does it like the Terminator. AI did it for to the whole world all at once. You know. Right. And, uh, right. it, it, it's it's different. It's not taking like actual true inspiration. It's just taking all of the bits, and of course, it's assembling it perfectly. It's a computer. My how, people how, are rising. How, I agree. That's what's happening. That's what's happening. <laughs> well, but that's that's one thing that I will say about AI, and I understand. Like, yeah, okay, a lot of people can put in prompts, get AI art, and get something that they can sell. And mm -hmm. I get that that's frustrating for people who have spent years honing their craft. But you know what? If you've owned your craft, you're the only one that can act. Right. because there's always something that is mm -hmm. missing and all the ai art i've ever seen it all feels a little Similar. artificial it all right yeah it's it, got that certain it, look to it it's got a certain thing to it yeah, yeah. i don't know i saw a really realistic black george washington the other day oh <laughs> <laughs> it fooled me i thought it was authentic well, <laughs> I thought for sure that was a picture of him with Marilyn Monroe and they were just both black and I didn't know like no yeah. really but yeah. the, the thing is there's AI art like yeah they can mimic a, a person they can mimic you know objects they can, yeah. they can mimic various things but when it comes to artwork and when you have really good artists like 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 look at this look at look at these how the hell is ai everything. gonna do that page well well the whole point of collecting like when i go to a show i go to a convention i collect someone's art for instance mm -hmm. the whole point of me collecting the art or to be ex or my excitement of getting the art is because i get to actually meet that person so it's about human interaction it's about you know so i, I understand that it's really cool to get something for free you know, or get something really, really cheap and you just get the product, yeah. you know, if you don't care about actually having that human well, element. To, you know? to I don't know. One of those people who want to pay <laughs> an exposure, <laughs> yeah. for everyone who wants to try and pay an artist an exposure, go to chat GPT and just do your shit over there. Right, I mean, stop I, worrying yeah, about paying but, us an exposure because it doesn't help. Right, <laughs> you know, I was going to say, I've never it. met, you know, Bill Mouse and I like his art. What about that? But I'm. But I'm I've, I've met I'm Bill Mouse, and I can I can vouch. I'm a real for boy. I'm, I'm flesh and blood. <laughs> okay, no, here's the way I look at it. Here's the deal. Bill's art has a distinct style, does it not? Yep. Uh, <laughs> other people yeah. like think they're collecting like, the person's signature. Think of other artists. It's like you know, like you know Jay Lee, who did a cover for Zen. Mike Mignola, Hellboy, and he did a cover for Zen. They all have such a distinct style. AI does not have a distinct style other than everything looks artificial. So well, like I've, I've, got a, I've got a John, gonna, I've got a John close. Severin, I've got a John Severin piece of art from a crack magazine issue that, that I bought uh, like some years ago. <laughs> and I, and I look at this piece and I've got it on my wall. I'm looking at it 
And I'm thinking to myself, wow, like that whole, the whole day he spent at his table drumming it or experience or coming up with the idea. And, you know, it's like there's an experience behind it. It's not just typing in to a prompt. I think instead of an AI right. artist, you should probably be called like an AI pilot or an AI. Legal. You know. Hey, Dan. Thank you for coming. Sorry, I don't mean to interrupt, no, no, but no, no, we love no, no. Booby Dan. Interrupting for the chat is 100% okay. Like, we have to always always say hi to the chat. We, always. We, like, Bo Booby Dan is like, he's like family. <laughs> we got to interrupt for him. <laughs> oh, absolutely. You had me at Booby. Boob Dan. Yes. Boob Dan. Look, you ever... You, you know, need I to think get Dan to draw near it. That's, you that's, that's a name I can get behind. I, I think uh, <laughs> Don is doing a very interesting stealth thing. He's been adding into the chat, and I believe oh, yeah. he also uh, just donated, you know, pledged. Am I right, Don? Yeah, I've I bought this ad roads cover just now. No, so. don't don't that's dox you your question. backers. That's against terms. Oh, what? <laughs> I'm not supposed to say. No, you you can say if you backed, you can say that you backed. But uh, people that can see it on the back end, don't talk about who backed what. But it, it's fine. <laughs> Don said yeah. it right here. See? Yeah. 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 Come on, chat. No, Don Don's perfectly legal to back because he's you know he's not the publisher. First comment. He, he didn't he didn't get it. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, Steve. We we can't, okay. Review, we can't well, reveal we can't reveal people's names. Get, I don't want to get Don's ass in a sling here. <laughs> no, 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 no. No. <laughs> No, thank you, Don. Thank you so much for for that. That's that's, that's that's awesome. Don's how we go around Red Valkyrie. <laughs> it may it may have been a minute, but Don knows he's been he's been around a few times. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. Speaking it's... of Don, uh, when are you gonna come back with with one of your many parody prospects? Oh man, uh, the muse hasn't hit me yet, but Bill and Bill and Steve are urging me to do something. Yeah, I just yeah. gotta. Oh, yeah. I, I'll let yeah, we, you guys be the first to know if I do, if I do. When, when the There's muse, when, when 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 the when the inspiration strikes, it's like you yeah. already know that you have the infrastructure ready to go. When uh, yeah. when we want to do something, the thing so that's you're fine. Funny is I don't I don't know why, and I I'll have to go back and see if I can find the exact uh, conversations. But I've had a few conversations with people over the past couple of weeks. Yeah, where you got mentioned, Don, and people really? were like. It would be really great if like Parody Press did something like that, and like somebody's wow. got to go tell Don. Mm -hmm. And I have oh, it. Cool. Like, I didn't even think of like I should DM Don right now and be like, well, by the well, way, well, Don, Don, go to go to my Facebook page. Uh, somebody, and it's I, 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 I'm forgetting the person's name because I just saw the review. Um, but somebody reviewed the Sewage Dragoon. <laughs> they, had, they hadn't seen it before, sure. and it's a it's and it's a really it's a really nice, thoughtful, uh, cool, awesome. uh, twelve minute review of the book. Wow! Yeah, I, I thought will. that was like super cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jump on my Facebook page uh, after we're all done with all this, and we'll, we'll jump see on my it. face. Book you page. see what happens? Wow. <laughs> so, so you know, Don and I were the co-publishers of the Zen books through Entity Comics, and right, I right. absolutely must do. A, a new project with Don and Bill, and as a matter of fact, Bill, yeah, I think we me. have that project. Do you remember what? the uh, elephant-related thing that you and I worked up? I do. I do Don't remember. Don't say anything that. more than I, elephant. I say no, no. I, it's it's yeah. We, we were good. We're, yeah, <laughs> Don, that was a good. We'll send, that was a very we'll send good you idea. Something. Okay. We'll yeah. send you something. <laughs> you may you may spark to it. Don's All gonna right. sharpen sharpen his writing skills upon this. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. It's Babar in uh, space. I know it. <laughs> <laughs> That's a pretty good idea. You actually. Sketch cover. Yes. I need a space elephant. Yeah. Oh. Oh, his his so ears. My mind. His big Dumbo ears are really solar sails. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's no like space it. involved. I'll tell you, but that's the idea. Yeah, we got a, we got a couple of cool things on. Uh, on the campaign there's uh there's sketch covers so like you like you're seeing they're just blank sketch covers there's right. uh there there is a original sketch tier um uh -huh. and i think it's in the mouse pack see those two brown sketches that are right there uh -huh. the little the little brown so one one is by cat mouse and one is by me and okay. and those are like seven by ten original sketches uh so that way they actually fit into i love fitting the sketches and bagging and boarding them like they're a comic book yep uh, I really, I really like doing that. And then we got posters, we got metal prints, we got a small yeah, metal art print. Oh, wow. And, uh, and then we have a mini print pack that'll actually be signed. 
by by all by all by everybody. It's like all the three artists involved. Uh, I'm gonna, and I'm Steve gonna grab a metal art print from our previous Kickstarter just to show you how amazing these look. Okay. Yeah, yeah, all they're right. super cool, and they're like eleven by seventeen. They're like big metal. So. Oh, nice! I I've got um, a really cool I'll have to show you later, like off stream. But I have a metal print that they did an acrylic top to, so they printed Ooh, it on metal, yeah, and uh -huh. then they coated it with an acrylic Ooh. top, and it is it is quality. Plus, they did a, a French cleat for you to to. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Look at these things. Yeah. I like it's that. metal. Very nice. Th th Those this, are cool, man. This yeah, was slice, the slice metal art fries. print from the, you know, the Lamore Supreme Zen Kickstarter, which we, you know, finished a couple months ago. And that was the very first Kickstarter that Zen has done in his 37 year history. But I have to show you one more, okay? Okay. Uh, All right. Let's see the next one. This, okay. In the pages of the Lamore Supreme Zen, uh, Joel uh, or Beta, i.e. Lamore Supreme and I created a female character. I think you'll get a kick out of this. This is also a metallic art print. Shy girl. Yeah. So, I thought you were trying to shake her yeah. boobs. Her. Oh, you're shaking her they boobs again. That. How does that look? <laughs> she does oh, look shy. Oh, <laughs> yeah, she looks very shy. And hey, I colored that I, one. This is the cosplay dream. I love it. That's why I called her Shy Girl. There is more Shy Girl product coming, including mm. Shy Girl product that Bill and I did. So wow. there's a lot coming down the pike here. So, so what you're what you're telling me is that uh, between Don, Steve, and Bill, I am not going to be hurting for cosplay material. No, not at all. <laughs> Fantastic. By the way, Don, I, you'll get a kick out of this. I got to show you. It's still hanging on my wall. Oh, oh that's, right. that's cool. Awesome. Yeah, that's sweet, man. I love that. Tell me the story of that Every time I hat. see it, it makes me giggle because I'm like, it's, it's like Domino's, but it's yeah. not. And Don, Don, I'm, I'm, I'm so happy with the way that Domino's. book came out, too. Uh, Which book is that? The, the X-Fars Reloaded. Yeah, we oh. first came on, on Shay and Sai's channel when we were promoting x -Fars. Uh, reloaded before before Beard Zerker and uh -huh, Shay uh -huh. was the first person to ever do a cosplay of one of our X X Men parody characters, and cool. she dressed up like Dom Domino's, who is a you know basically <laughs> Domino, Domino, but yeah. as a as a pizza delivery girl. So it was well, awesome. The, you know, my favorite part is that night I uh -huh. ordered from Domino's and <laughs> I just kept the hat on and was like, nice. yeah, and they they looked and they were like. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I, my pizza. I was like, thanks, I'm gonna do it. Like, bye. I, so I, you, I don't know what that was. <laughs> that's funny. You purposely did that to freak out the pizza delivery guy. Huh? <laughs> the, mul <laughs> the multiverse is, is real, dude. One of the my favorite things. Wow. I've, my, my P.O. Box uh, over at the UPS store, like the guys that own the UPS store, not only do they watch the channel from time to time and they're super mm -hmm. sweet, like great friends, good supporters, I've shown up in cosplay to pick up an item because like i'll have something that will get delivered last minute that i need for my mm. cosplay mm. and i'm already 75 percent of the way in it and i'm like i really need this for the show and so i'll show up in like half cosplay and i'm like hey guys how's it going and they're like are you streaming tonight and i'm like yeah yeah if I, can, I just need to get that real quick so i can finish this and they're like that's cool this looks like a lot awesome. uh we'll, we'll awesome. be watching because i'm curious <laughs> Okay, do, oh, you, do, do you do uh, conventions other than very local ones to you? Have you been to Comic-Con, for example? So I haven't, unfortunately, been to many. I've been to Baltimore Comic-Con, but that's mm -hmm. literally, like, my neck of the woods. I've been to Tidewater Comic-Con. Right, um, right. I actually haven't, I haven't been able to hit the con circuit yet, mostly because I don't have leave. So um, not having enough leave to, you know, I can't just tell the military like, hey, I'm going to go dress up for right. the convention. Can you, yeah. can you just be cool with it and let me go? They're like, no, no, <laughs> no, we're not. It's like, just give me my pension. So I just do whatever I want. Oh my gosh. Two years, two years. Two, more, what two years? years? Oh my God. That's awesome. Two years will fly by. You're going to be good. You're going to be good to go. I am so excited. And then y'all are going to see Sai and I at all the conventions and doing all the crazy stuff. Awesome. Probably with this terror of a cat. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. I, okay. 
Yeah, well, we uh, first comics, you know, our publisher, uh, we do a lot of major conventions uh, up to and including Comic Con. Yeah. I've, mm -hmm. I've done Comic Con oh, yeah. now for at least the last decade. Every year we have sure. a booth. It's uh, it's crazy. It's like 180,000 people oh, yeah. were there last year. Mm -hmm. It's wow. like nutty. Oh, really? We were very close to going to New York Comic Con and everything fell apart very last minute and we were devastated. Mm. But hopefully, hopefully. You forgot we went to Baltimore. No, I already said Baltimore because he, okay. he said not local to us. Right. So Baltimore Comic Con. Oh, well, yeah, Con. it's local to you. Gotcha. Yeah, it's uh, within, yeah. if it's within five hours of, if I can drive there and the military won't make me be on leave, I'm, tell, I'm calling it local. Right. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, but technically I could have gone to New York Comic Con. Yeah, exactly. Local. Thank um, you for proving yeah, my point. Hopefully in in two years, Sai and I will be hitting up all the cons <sighs> on top of all of our other side hustles. And I am so down for representing people's indie comic creations. So y'all let me know if you need if you need a girl in cosplay i am so ready <laughs> well there's going to be a lot of activity on shy girl over the next year or two i would say so keep that in mind i i will i will start looking at my cosplay supplies and see what i can build out because i i gotta you go, tell you, you go. when I'll i did you when i did the, again when i did the one for bill when i was near at specifically mm -hmm. off of the pirate cover like yep, bill yep. i don't think you understand not only was that my first full cosplay that wasn't part of a pub crawl right um, right yeah because i i mean clearly like you have a going away in england what do you do you dress up as super villains and hit every pub because it's funny uh, <laughs> <laughs> but that was the first like full cosplay that i did and i sewed my own top for that <laughs> which i have not had to do yet i've been i've been lucky enough to find things that i could alter i literally from the ground up sewed that top and, and was very was proud of it and the fact that it stayed together and what was the character uh it Nira. was Nira x but it, it was, was Nira it x was, oh it was Nira. Yeah. Oh, but it was specifically her as the pirate, pirate version her pirate yeah. version if yeah. you have a if you have photos of that which i suspect you do I'd oh, love I to see some because then we'll circulate yeah. them around. You know, I think it's a great thing. Bill probably has no, already I'll, done that. Definitely, yeah, but, I'll definitely grab some. Because, would you? Um, yeah, absolutely. For sure. Yeah, yeah. We've we've got we've got them. I uh, actually. Those pictures of you and Cat are like the classic ones. I love those pictures. You guys oh, just shit. Three pictures ever. <laughs> <laughs> right. But yeah. We'll 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 get them. We'll get them sent out to y'all. Um, cool. Okay. Enough of enough of the networking. Y'all are here to see <laughs> the book. Let's talk about the book. Like Don's like I back like book. twenty minutes ago. We haven't talked about anything. We're forty three <laughs> minutes in. There's a book. Yeah. Oh, uh, is there? oh, oh yeah. good, right good point. Yeah. Oh, what is this? In the red boundary chat, the link is pinned. You can just go to the pinned link right up there and oh, buy it. Backing. Yeah. Yeah. Buy, please, buy please support. And uh, if if you back or even if you don't back, please like and share and because really the only way that that uh, the only the only way i can extend my reach past the algorithm is if, if everybody here uh kind of helps me out so it's i'm not very true and everybody's yeah. got it doesn't matter how many followers you have how big or small you are right. everybody has a different piece of that algorithm sharing it out in any capacity is going to help get it in front of new eyes at some point so please yeah. make sure that you're sharing this campaign out share out the stream share out whatever you possibly right can on. to uh to try and help this campaign out and if you're going to share out the stream we should probably make it somewhat informative about what you can get on this campaign <laughs> instead Aww. of just bullshit we love to bullshit okay it's super fun look at all this stuff oh bill God. explain all this beautiful stuff bill yes so let's let's go yep, through yeah. let's go through your tears bill <clears throat> all right let's go let's go through the let me see because you're the, the middle of the screen is like way down, but They're then you're right. starting, you're starting with the uh, there you go, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that way it's kind of like a little Those bit side to side. All right, so there. Go. a lot of stuff there. <laughs> there's a lot, there's a lot of things, a lot of things. So there's, okay, there we are. Yeah, there's, yeah, there's the there, there's the regular, uh, that's yeah. the main cover to the book, very, and uh, nice. there's a digital P, you can start with the digital PDF here, 
um, which is great. It's just five bucks, you know. Like if you haven't, right. you haven't if, if for some reason you haven't seen Zen before, um, you just want to try out the book or just lend some support. That would be incredible. Here's the yeah. uh, the main cover, physical copy. The physical copy comes with access to a PDF. So all the physical tiers will also yes. have access yeah. to the PDF. Mm -hmm. Oh, that is awesome. I love, I love when people do that because it's so difficult, especially if you travel a lot or if you're hitting up the concert. You're like, I don't, I don't want my comics getting damaged. I don't want right, to, right, right, right. you know, pack them, and, but I still want to be able to read stuff. And, so and, I, and, and I feel like it's, PDF. I feel like it's a little bit of a thank you for supporting us in the first place. So it's like, yeah. at least, at least having access and having a, a free digital PDF so you can throw it in your media collections on your computer. Right. Uh, yeah, good to go. <clears throat> Sorry, I muted myself because I had to cough again. Thank you, we Cole. Heard, we, we heard the cough. Oh yeah. no, I tried you, to mute you it in time. Your mute roll. You got I know. One. Damn it. <laughs> There's Bill. Save, was right. save your Here's... save save it. You save your voice, Bill. That's Bill's awesome wraparound cover. Okay, which is an, another option. Uh, you can buy the, that that one. If you want the wrap around, I love it. Absolutely. Doesn't it look yeah. fantastic? Okay. Got, got, got some cool uh, badass bounty hunters Sweet. on the back cover. Look at the cat mouse cover. Now, the, the cat, cat mouse, mouse cover, cover blew me away. It's crazy. It's Wait, like there are no there are no girl boobs. <laughs> Don't worry, she's got she's got another. There's another print. Okay. That, that, I'm, I'm waiting. Chat. One of the most awesome iconic images of Zen ever. Yeah, she did a really, really nice job. Super proud of this piece. He is very and, imposing. And so and it's this, and, and it's the cat mouse. This is a her art style always leans a little bit towards manga more than yeah. Western art. It's just like, so it's really, really cool seeing that uh come out. I, I I really love seeing different artists take on the same character. You know, like what's what's how do you see the character, you know? Mm -hmm. I love that. That's, I love that's that. always yeah. what I, I like to do too. I love to see like when we do our persona characters, we have somebody draw mm -hmm. them. I love to see what other people pick up when it comes to like Yeah, yeah. The version of me. I know Sai Sai has very specific things that they like to make sure they I do. I do. Size a picky bitch. But I love to see <laughs> yeah, I like people are like, well what like what to draw? And I'm like, go nuts, dude. Like it red hair viking, have fun. Mm. Well, and, Shay, and you know how you were just after me to make a background that actually has our characters on it? Yes. I see that you... Yeah! Woo! Sweet. <laughs> cool. And it's something, something else to mention, too, is that just about everything is available as an add-on. So if you're not going to miss out on something that you might want, because, you know, like, you only get access to the add-on store when you pick a tier, right? A physical right. tier. Um, so you can basically build your own. You, you can basically build your own. So if you see a cover that you want, okay, pick out the tier. Um, you'll be able to add on uh, just about everything on the campaign and a la carte uh, yourself. So you, you'll be able to add on different things if uh, if you see it on there and you would like to have it. So That's try to make it try to make it easy. So there's people. the yeah. cat cover. You can scroll I wanted, up. I wanted to point out for uh -huh. anyone who is yeah. unfamiliar with cats, uh, ability to draw incredibly well-defined muscular uh men bod that she's she's, she's quite good look at that under like, like the little underlighting, the underlighting and stuff yeah on the ribs yeah. you, know, you know what bill bill told me wait but you know what bill told me he he posed for that picture so so <laughs> pat could get it right <laughs> How kind. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. But and, Bill's the planet. Yeah. I know. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you very much, everybody. We're going we're going home. All right, there we go. Over it all. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. I had to. So so here we have Thad Rhodes. The Thad Rhodes cover that we talked about yeah. already. Yeah. Yeah. yeah just, the digital work. digital fun. This is so so good. I really like it. Um I, we like to offer a blank sketch cover because we always get asked about that. People like to take them to shows, have their right. favorite artists draw on them or have them draw it on them themselves, you know, yeah. so so it's available as, uh, and it's also now, available you, as, as add-ons too. Did you pick a good paper for the sketch cover so the ink just doesn't slide off? <laughs> Oh, I, 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 I did I did mention the first comic. His first comics uh, is doing all the fulfillment and picking uh -huh. out printers, and they know what, they know what they're doing. They know what they're doing. 
I did. I, I posed <laughs> belly up. <laughs> uh, see, it could it could have been his belly. I it could have also been Bill without a hat on. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> it could have been so many things. Oh my god! The round globe of one of his ass cheeks. You don't know. I'm- I'm just, you don't know what it is. You know what it is. <laughs> now I understand. Is going to be good enough to take wash because. Oh my god. Now, now I understand size, a <laughs> sense of humor. Yeah, size, size is brutal. Size is just the Bill brutal. Mouse stomach, Jelly Mouse mouth. Don, that's, I can't that's lie. bad, bro. Bill, Bill, if you made it happen, I can't say I wouldn't get it. I'm just saying. I, I, I think I just, would. It's part of the I mean, artist. It's, I, it's, I wouldn't. It's part your, of the your wrists would always be rolling off to one side or the no, other. Like, it's, really, it's really simple. You still do it the two, but instead of like how it's normally boobs, you have one of it is is Bill's belly, and the other one is Waffle's head. Oh, oh there we go. Oh, oh that's cute. It's he does. He, he does. He now. does sleep on my belly. Oh crap. It would now, be perfect. Now I gotta stay fat. <laughs> yeah, that's the reason. That's yeah. the reason. Uh, That's bundles. always the reason. Check out these cool so, so we do have, filters. yeah, we got some, no. we got some cool bundles. It's so clean. this, this is the mouse pack. Okay, so <laughs> yeah. it's, it's, this comes with, uh, this comes with the regular main cover, the wraparound cover, and the cat mouse cover, and then the wraparound cover is also a uh, eleven by seventeen poster, yeah. and then it also comes with two original sketches of zen oh, yeah. now one out of 10 sketches out of all of the sketches that we're going to do for the campaign one out of 10 is going to be a nira sketch so you don't know where that's going to end up so but there's going to be two sketches one by cat one by myself and uh and like this is just a sample of what they are i'll probably do a couple that are like a little bit more like not totally full body but a little bit more like action poses and things like that so they'll all be different they'll all be unique they won't just all be just straight profiles that's awesome. Right, cool, if, any, cool. if, if anyone has seen our art auctions when Bill and Kat get on there and show their wares, especially on like the tone paper, they are so freaking good at doing. I I, so, I really I really like working on the tone paper. You get a little I bit keep more. To find it, Bill, and I keep on like not finding it anywhere. Local, we we saw some, online. and it was yeah. so expensive. Oh, yeah, like, like, like it's uh, either an insane amount of money or it's like this big, and I'm like, I'm not, I'm not gonna pay thirty dollars for you know twenty shoes. No, no, literally, wear, yeah. literally, literally, this right here, this right here. It, it comes in a, in a in a in a ring to binder. Let me show you the cover of it, so that way, that way you know. Yeah, this is this is what it is. What it's the just hell? Regular is toe paper. Can, can you find yeah. it there? Um, I think you can find it at Michaels. I believe I've okay. seen it at Michaels before. It's just Strathmore. Tone, tan paper. Uh, yeah. a, okay. a book comes with fifty sheets, which is like a How ton. How much did that book cost? I don't remember, but I remember it, it wasn't like crazy expensive. I, I probably got it on sale for fifteen or twenty bucks, maybe or something, okay. something like that. So, yeah, yeah, it's a, they, they sell larger pads and different kinds of tone paper that are like way more expensive. But uh, hey, Shay. it's just sketch yeah. paper, it's just regular sketch. Nine paper. by twelve, fifty yeah. sheets. Yep. 14 bucks yeah. on Amazon. There you, there you go. go. That's uh, it. That's you know, it. Yep. Really funny I knew it. I, knew it. I, I, it I found, uh, I it found one on the support my book. that's seven dollars. <laughs> <laughs> buy, buy my book. Buy, buy Bill's book. Bill, I'm, just gonna, gonna, I'm just going to. I'm just going to. I'm going to hold up like a like a little container. It's like, please support my book, Mister. <laughs> I need some money. With like two coins in it that you can just shake at people. Nine dollars at Michael's. Uh, yes. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah, you, you can yeah. find them on sale. You can find them on sale because they a lot of times they they order a lot of it, here. and if it doesn't sell fast enough, they'll put it on on, on special or markdown or whatever. That, can I can I just say I love when Michaels tried to get into the cosplay scene because they bought a shit ton of Warbola and then I the remember Michaels around me did yeah. not move it, so I got right. it for like seventy percent off, and that's hey. expensive. Yeah. You are Maybe. saving that for when I do my armor cosplay. We're, see, see. We're saving some of oh, it. Free. It's not all going to you, you greedy bitch. It's. Have you seen the cosplay? No. There's a lot. It's fine. There's a lot. <sighs> what armor? Well, what you mean, Mandalorian oh, armor or what? No, 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 no. No. <laughs> I don't it's watch. Not a very elaborate armor that they. Were I do not watch gay Disney Star Wars. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> 
Alright, let's try to make up collection. <laughs> Roll right past. All right, Die. make sure I muted myself for the uh, the cough there. Uh, okay, so uh, after that we have the print collection. So there's there's the regular edition of the book. Okay, um, there is the poster. There is three metal art prints that are like they're unique from from the rest of the book. Um, and there's three small prints that are next to the book uh, up in the top. Those are mini prints that are like seven by ten. And those mini prints will be signed. So I'll sign my cover. Cat will sign hers. Thad will sign his. And of course, co-creator and writer Steve Stern will sign all three of them. I can sign any damn thing I want. That's right. That's the way it is. <laughs> I love so, it. so this is the complete print collection. And plus, it also comes with the PDF of the book. Yeah, yeah, everything yeah. comes with the PDF. So. You all see the, the right here. It's a little PDF. A little PDF. <laughs> little, little digital happiness. Yeah. Look at that Wait. bundle, Bill. What the yeah. hell's in that bundle? Th this is this is this is everything, bro. This is this is the big boss tier. You walk in, you you walk oh, in. Wait you a own, minute. You own that store. boss tier is that the one that only one person can buy? No, no. The the big boss tier everybody can get into. Totally okay. cool. Uh, okay. There's one tier past this that is the final final boss tier. Um, this the final one boss tier. The final well, boss. Guess what? The I, final I got a Street Fighter kind of attitude. For eight hundred dollars, has already been bought. It, it, wow. Yeah, it went. It went fast. I was. I was actually very, very happy about that. So it's like super, awesome. super thanks. Uh, the big boss here. <laughs> yeah, the big boss here has everything. It's got the. It's got all the covers that are available. Uh, my covers, Cat's cover, Thad's cover, the blank cover. It's got the mini prints. It's got the metal prints. It's got the two original sketches. It's wow. got the poster. It's it's the whole deal. It's the whole deal. Everything on the menu. We have an add-on request. Zen Zen no. Mouse <laughs> you know, happen too. You know, I, I think Kat would design that one. I think oh, I think yeah. she would have fun designing that. I think she would love to design that one. I think that she's <laughs> the, the Zen six pack mouse pad. <laughs> there you go. There you go. <laughs> I don't think Kat even works in six packs. I think she's like eight. 10, 12, like 24 packs. Wow. <laughs> yeah. She yeah, makes she's, them work. She, she a makes case work. of abs. Wow. <laughs> one pallet of abs, please. Right. And there's, there's the one that was bought on the first day. Yeah, that was oh, yeah. That, 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 went, that went fast. Super, super happy about that. Um, and it was everything on the menu plus the original art for the main cover of the book. Wow. Amazing. Yeah. Some, somebody looked into that. Let's not and say their name out really, loud. No, no, no. They can't <laughs> no. say their name out loud. And you know, Bill, Bill and I thought we might know this person because, you know, Kickstarter shows you the name. We don't know this person at all. Neither of us does. No, I think it's fantastic. Wow. I think it's fantastic. It's, it's Shay's alias. <laughs> oh, that would have been awesome. Shay does not have that kind of money. <laughs> as much as I would love to. Holy shit. Oh, yeah, this is the cosplay, by the way. Oh, that I'm my saying. God. Oh, that's real serious. Uh, cool, cool. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's gonna look dope. So you're putting that together, uh, Sai? It's it's a goal. It's a goal. Yeah, four well, goals are good. <laughs> it's a dream. Got it. It's have a, a goal. <laughs> we'll make it. We'll make it a thing. Dick. It's a lot though. That's <laughs> 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 great. Bill, did you? Bill, buy Buy your own art. <laughs> so Kevin, says, yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying to make myself look good, man. I gotta, gotta, gotta buy my own art. Buy you know, my, yes. just, my that's, multiple that's personality. Like, that's like drug money laundering, where you have that much of a diminishing return when Kickstarter takes their cut. Well, no, you know, kidding. you know, oh Bill. Uh, that's rough. That's rough. Some of Bill's <laughs> original uh, Zen pages have been at auction at Heritage Auctions, which is like the right. biggest, you know, auction house. In his pages, his individual pages, are sold for upwards of six hundred dollars already. So, wow. you know, Bill, yeah, uh, yeah. It, it'd be why Bill would be a good investment right now. I would say a very good investment. Absolutely. Uh, By Grabthar's hammer, what a savings! <laughs> That's a great. Favorite movie ever. Oh, it's, such, it's such a good like every time I watch Rickman it, is I amazing. love it more. It's, yeah, it's ridiculous. The first time I saw it, I didn't like it. And the more I watched it, I was like, "This is." This is it, yeah, it really grows on you after a while. It does. It does. It does. But okay, here's All a right. look at the poster. It's like a nice so look at the add-ons. 
Yeah, and there's there's uh, things that yeah, and the the poster, all these things, everything on the campaign is is an add-on. So you can you you don't have to get one of the bundles if there's something in there you don't want. You can actually kind of mix and match and put things put things in there. So we have this is a metal print. Good zen, posing all cool. I, I, he almost looks like he's gonna do like a rap album. He is totally yeah. dropping his album right now. He is ready. <laughs> he, he, goes, Shay, he goes by uh, MCZ. Shay, you know the song that's stuck in my head after I sent you that link for it earlier. What? Oh, gosh. <laughs> so there's a commercial that plays around here. That What's the original song, Shay? I can't even remember. Uh, I Wanna Rock. And, oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And so there's a, <laughs> so there's a version of that in, uh, in, in the commercial that plays around here and every time it plays all i hear is the spongebob song i'm a goofy goober <laughs> 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 because it's a knockoff of that song so that's oh that's gosh. what that's what he's cool. about to riff wow. all right all right hold on one second hold on uh-huh. 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 i need about 350 <laughs> there we go. <laughs> nice, Ken. I like how Ken, Ken has been around here enough that he he knows the ends. So he's like, yeah, yeah. yeah. He, he knows what videos I have loaded up. <laughs> he does. He knows exactly what videos I have loaded up on the stream. Uh, by the way, love this one. Like, oh, thank you. Um, yeah, near near with a little uh, kind of a cyberpunk kind of city in the background, just kind of chilling. Yeah. It's like I, I I designed this costume so it was like specifically for this story. Um, I wanted her to have like a unique look for for the Bounty Wars four issue series. So oh, yeah. so that's this. So I, I got her got her chilling with some yeah. uh, little, little tactical outfit there with her I original might, outfit I underneath it. To, I might have to make this. Did you yeah. color these like, bill or did cat? Although... I actually colored these, yeah. And Kat did, uh, for, obviously for Kat's cover and all that, you know, she did all of that herself. Um, but anything up on the campaign page as far as my stuff, yeah, it's, I, I colored all that. Thanks, dude. Shay, where does where do your eyes go? Uh, my Honestly, you want uh-huh. to yeah, uh-huh. honestly know where my eyes go on this? The first place they go is for upper thigh leading into the wrap. Oh, butts are tight. Some are, yeah, for sure. For sure. <laughs> you read it. You read it right. because it's shiny and it's it's literally where Don't where your eye is. No, no the the the, the direction of the leg, yeah. uh-huh. the the flow of the image, the direction of the leg leads your eyes directly oh, to her ass. Thank you, dude. You swoop down to and go up to move. And oh, it's shiny. It's all very shiny. Yes. Okay. I got. I got. I got. I got. I got three M and M's from uh, from David. David. David is now this, Catherine's this boyfriend. This is a piece. This is another cat mouse piece. Uh, you see the mouse. We all, all got to hang out at the show now. Look at uh, look sweet. at the manga influence on uh, I, on. Uh, I see the eighty three muscles uh, on his yep. side. Too. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And, yep, yep. and looking at the way that she did, like it, it comes down really. It comes down to not just like the the profile and the jaw shape, but the uh-huh. hot. Like yeah, when yeah. you talk when you talk good manga, it's got Eight that eye, and she did it perfect. Where she's just like mm, okay. just like that. Mm, kind of look where she's yeah, you might, so you might be you might be we might be seeing some more from cat here fairly soon by the way that's bill all, that's all i'll say about that you you never tell men online that any female that they've seen online yeah. has yeah. a girlfriend it instantly kills some of the allure yeah, what i meant to say was that was uh david he uh he lives downstairs and he just brings me m ms that's how he pays that's up. that's cat's gay yeah. friend yeah <laughs> So his uh, her gay friend is downstairs watching TV in a separate room. David, if you're yeah. watching this, we love you and we mean it with, with nothing but love. I know we haven't like met met, but like just uh-huh. it's okay. Just trust us. We love you. Anyway, I thought I would keep the allure since I was still single. Quite a catch, am I right, ladies? <laughs> <laughs> I draw comics. I draw comics above the garage. I'm sure you wanted to get to know me. Yeah, the mouse, the mouse belly pad really uh, sold mouse it. Belly pad, belly I know. Pad, yeah, that'll that'll be my version of uh, like some kind of like a dating well, app. I'll just pass out the belly pads. Make sure that that in the any belly button, there's like a sponge for for ink, so make it real fuzzy inside there. We'll make it a stretch goal on this. Make it a pencil holder. Just... Yeah. 
Mouse belly <laughs> page, stretch guys. goal. <laughs> what do we have here, Bill? What are those? This, this is the print pack, the signed print pack. Print so pack, yeah. uh, the print pack are seven by 10 smaller. prints. Um, oh my God. And, 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 okay. Yeah, yeah, so they'll be, they'll be, uh, they'll be uh, bagged and boarded just like the comic book. Um, each one will be signed by their respective artist and also signed by Steve Stern, the co-creator and writer of Zen. You make it sound like I'm demanding I sign everything, but if people want you are. Picture, no, I'm, 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 actually, I'm, I'm, I'm actually demanding that you sign it. So when I mail you this oh, pack of right. prints, you're going to spend a whole weekend signing prints. Jesus. <laughs> I this, know, right? You know, this, makes me, this makes me feel like when uh, we met when we met Jason Jason Bascom and he had this mm -hmm. absolute book. He was like, "Shay, you have to sign these." And I was like, "Dude, all I did was edit." And he's like, "But I'll be the only one that has them signed by you." That is so incorrect. Unfortunately, yeah, yeah, yeah. so I might have beat you to that. And he's like, yeah. "I'll be the second person to have them signed <laughs> by you." Uh -huh. <laughs> I was like, "Okay, okay, it's fine." <laughs> I like how he didn't want to leave me like sad and and depressed so he had me sign the uh the the cyborg sketch cards valkyrie. yeah yeah no it was it was the um the foil cards the cyborg valkyrie foil uh -huh. mm -hmm. oh, nice nice because he did so, he did a, a red valkyrie and a cyborg valkyrie gotcha, for people gotcha. who don't know red valkyrie is actually both of us but it's fine whatever yes uh so you can get an original sketch pack which is awesome. Yeah, yeah, the original sketch pack, seven by ten again. So it's that nice little size that we can we can bag and board, and everything stays safe inside that that Gemini oh box. Unless you get the metal prints that are eleven by seventeen, you get a slightly larger box. But my goodness, with metal prints, it's bulletproof at that point, so nothing's going to get damaged in that right. box. I love seeing the difference in the style between my drawing and Cat's drawing. I think it's just yeah, it's, it's really it's it's cool. Funny because with all of like the cutesy stuff i've seen cat do i almost would think it was it should be flipped but then <laughs> when you see cat draw like her her dudes right you right look at that and you're like no no that's cat that's uh, definitely cat and then you're like, except for the cat, one yeah. except for the one i apparently bought because it looked like a chick oh well it's because she went more androgynous and that's why you love it it is <laughs> what, what do we have here, Bill? We just have a nice, this is a nice little picture of Zen going, and he's, he's singing, he's a goofy goober. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this, honestly, Bill, in the future. I'm sorry, this is right, right in the middle of that song when he does the Van Halen bit. That's what yep. gets me. That's the part that gets me. It would be such a cool, like, acrylic pin. That it oh, would yeah. be good, but you know, it, it, this is one of our stretch goals. We do have some die cut stickers that will be coming as stretch nice. goals. You'll see so, them. You'll see them as you keep. You'll, you'll, yeah, you see them as you as you come down. I think we're actually at the end of the add on stuff, and I think we're into the stretch goal stuff. There you go. Yeah. Ooh, look at that spot oh, glow. Everybody spot. loves some spot UV. Come on now. So yeah, spot UV for all the covers. Once we hit the six thousand dollars stretch goal, right? That's our that's our first little bit of stretching. So then, so you're. You're like what halfway there ish. That's oh, yeah. awesome. Kind of, we'll, yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll yeah. We'll, we'll yeah, 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 yeah. And then uh, at ten thousand, we'll get this die cut. Hopefully, like a like I'm not quite sure. It should be like probably five inches tall, maybe four inches yeah. wide. It's like a like a nice little oversized uh, die cut sticker with Zen this and that cool. And it's cool rat pose. Water bottle. <laughs> yeah. So I can have a Zen wrapper yeah. on my water yeah. bottle. Yeah. Yeah, like, that'd be dope. That? I'd be like, love it. Bro, love you, it. You don't know. It's like, you oh don't my know, god, man. Ken. The Bell Mouse Pad is <laughs> stretch mark. That's stretch mark. Oh, Very, good. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. The, the Bell Mouse like Pad might that. eventually become a thing. It's sticking. Oh god. And then ah. 15,000 will have the Nira X die cut mm -hmm. sticker. And you can uh, you can have your eyes drawn to her derriere as much as you you like. I would, I, <laughs> there you I go. Put that, I would put that front and center <laughs> on my water bottle, so when I went to go play volleyball, people would just stare at her. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Distracting, distracting. Gonna need that in a banner. Yeah, right. Yeah. I'm just gonna put it behind me when I'm playing volleyball, and then they mm -hmm, won't mm -hmm. see that I'm about to mm -hmm. spike it down their throats because they'll be like, mm -hmm. "There's a shiny button in the background." And I can't that's see. that's gonna be the the placard that I hold up on the sidelines mm -hmm. to say "Go Shay." Oh it's gonna be we, gonna be near. We got we, we got some other stretch goals in mind just in case the campaign does go past yeah, twenty thousand. Yeah, I'm a stretch goal as you can so, see. If we meet a yeah. hundred thousand, Steve comes to your house. I come to your house <laughs> and I cook dinner for you. 
There you go. Some <laughs> some, some 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 blue steak. <laughs> I mean, not a and, true stretch goal. You are not getting Steve at your house, but still get them to twenty. And in this economy, that might be worth it. Yeah. <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> I mean, like, in this economy. I can cook. I do cook. So you know, there you go. And there's so Bill. You got, so you got little write-ups of all of us uh, near the bottom here, so you can learn a little bit about the, the creative team, as it were. Cat. Look at look at Cat. Oh She's got gosh, the coolest picture. Cute picture of Cat. Aww. Yeah, I love that picture. Cat. Hey, look at Thad Rhodes. Look at Thad. Thad. Look at Thad you. looking so cute. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell I'm him gonna, to watch this just so I can say that. Got a team there. I'm gonna, got a I'm, team. gonna I'm gonna have to hit Thad up. We're gonna have to be besties. We gotta do merch together. Oh Dude, yeah. I'm serious. I, I know that he would love it. Yep, I know that he would love it. I'm serious. Give him a freaking Twitter or some shit. I don't know. Well, well you know, I'll, 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 I'll hook you guys up. Don't even worry about it. You know, there's been a, over the years a ton of Zen merch. The two video games, the line of action figures, the chromium wow. cards, the Halloween mask, the pens, pencils, notebooks, mm -hmm. the, the vinyl model kits. I could go on, but why? Why should I? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Uh, this is such a freaking fun campaign. I love uh, that you. you guys are already doing so well. Despite thank you. Thank you. Uh, just you know, despite the somewhat soft launch that we won't talk about, because it's the real launch. It's where you people. This is be. the this is the real launch. It couldn't yeah. have been better than than this I venue. Want. You guys are awesome. <laughs> Thank you. I'm You're glad welcome. that you enjoyed it. And Don, you have been shockingly quiet, just smiling, like you do. Don's just I'm here to be here. pretty. And smile. Yeah, these guys are my buddies, and I, I love them, and it's, it makes me feel young again just hanging out with them. Hey, Don, uh, dude. Don, I, I think thought you were hanging out project. like this. You're like, I am the Don father. Don, I think we have a project. We'll talk about it. All right, man. I, Not good. the space elephant? <laughs> Can't say anything. Can't say anything. <laughs> do, do oh, like my God. Dumbo, Winnie the Pooh, like, crossover... <laughs> I don't know. Something. It's gonna be it's gonna be something crazy and cool. That's what I. That's when what we I do know. it, we'll we'll launch launch it right here. Wouldn't launch it anywhere else. Shay and Hell Cy. Yeah. <laughs> Look at Don's hamsters. Don's Everybody's hamsters. Just guessing now. They're like, Don's doing something. Is he doing this? Is it this? Is it down? <laughs> I thought. I thought, I thought. I thought he was calling us Don's Don's hamsters. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we are. <laughs> People still love what? the hamsters. I'm they do. They do. They Just do a, do. do a do a Stargate crossover with hamsters. <laughs> really? I like that. I like that. That is actually so fucking amazing. Well, there was an episode of uh, SG One <laughs> where yeah. um, it was like reality was breaking down, and yeah. and they they were turning into all kinds of weird shit uh, mm -hmm. in the episode. <laughs> Unless that was a parody on some other show, but it was it was interesting. Bob's Burgers parodied that. Yeah, and it they, was, they, it they. was the episode where they had fans uh, draw, like do fan art or whatever, and then they turned that into animation. So every time like a, a scene change happened, it was a different mm -hmm. art style. Yeah. From a different fan. <laughs> it was very trippy. At trippy. one point, they all turned into Muppets. It was super creepy. <laughs> Uh, oh, thanks, Crooked. What a thank nice you, guy. Thank you, for the $26 because Sai has a little extra. So Sai gets you. a little extra money. Hold on. We'll see the, the dancing taco we'll see the here. The dancing taco <clears throat> actually shows up. Wait, where's my tits? <laughs> Radioactive black belt hamsters. Yes, Kevin. <laughs> I can't Who's find the oh, The, the, the delay is for real, man. Wow. Hey, this has been so much fun, folks. I can't yeah. thank you enough. <laughs> yeah, thanks, everyone. It's really fun. It's, it's been awesome. Sai, are, are, you, are you hitting the button or can I make you small again? It, awesome. it, it will come through on its own, Shay. That's the point in having Streamlabs. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll hit the fucking button. Hold on. Thank you. <laughs> God, I am so impatient. Cool. I don't like waiting for Streamlabs. That has it's like almost, it's almost like you're a woman. <laughs> almost like one of us is a woman. Oh, There's going to be some That's slander. disputes tonight. There will be. 
<laughs> we are uh, so we are very close to hitting that three thousand, and uh, the pledge, the goal is only forty five hundred, which is um, abysmally low, and it must get higher than that, or it will be. There we go. Upset. There's oh, dancing yeah. taco. Dancing oh, taco. taco. Dancing taco. Oh, how cute! <laughs> Cheese all over Sai's face. It's Oh. Hey, hey, at least it's cheese. <laughs> yeah, it, it, you're you're the one that made this. I'm just saying, I did not choose Dancing Taco. Hey, no attention to the bottom right QR code. The only track. Only? Yes, is an actual QR code and will take you to size only fans. I'm just saying. Just saying. Enjoy. Yep. <laughs> My currently blank only fans. Yes. All right. <laughs> Dread, Dread agrees with me. It only took a year. I, yeah, <laughs> right. Um, okay, cool. Yeah. Is there anything else that uh, we'll go around in a circle? Don, is there anything else that you want to say before we wrap? Um, I do have a project that's in the wings that's with uh, Fourth Age Comics. It's a Thomas Valiant Putty Man story. So when, when that comes out, I'll, I'll definitely let people know online. Cool. Definitely do. And cool, uh, just cool. to give you a heads up, Don, because it's been a minute since you've been around here, we're booking like two months out. So, Oh, wow. Okay. So Sweet. The, like, literally, the moment you have like an inkling of a date, like, let me know. Okay. Uh, so, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. so great that you're uh, having the success you have because it's very well deserved. Thank you. So not very only nice are we more popular with creators, but it also helps that Shay is no longer willing to do six of these uh, shows a week uh, and kill herself <laughs> with all the cosplays right. yeah it's, true. it's a lot of work was, right. at one point i was doing eight shows in seven days and i don't even know how that happened because i wow. still had two jobs going i don't it's know hard. when i don't yeah. think i slept I, I think i just i like i white roomed for a while yeah, um, yeah. Uh, don't yeah. You, gotta, you gotta be kind to yourself you know you can't yeah. stress yourself out <laughs> And see, that's because it, I'm it. more kind to myself, the cosplays are looking better than, you know, when they, like, fall apart. Because they used to fall <laughs> apart when I was on stream. <laughs> I was saying something, I'm like, and I would pop out, and I was like, well, well. that's done. Can't, <laughs> can't fix that live. <laughs> uh, Steve, it was yeah. wonderful having you on. Is there anything else you want to tell people before we wrap? Well, I would just say that uh, mm -hmm. I, I look forward to working on a a project with my former co-publisher Don and Bill and that will be in the offing and I want to thank you both again this was great thank you so happy to have you guys Bill you got anything you want to tell the people please buy my book <laughs> just, keep just, it short and simple keep it short and simple <laughs> Buy my uh, yeah, I mean, we're we're working really hard on the Kickstarter. Uh, we're we're deep into uh, actually working on uh, the art for the interior pages and all the good stuff. And uh, we actually spent a lot of time creating the Kickstarter page itself. And uh, we have That's a lot great. of people. Yeah, we have a lot of people uh, behind us and a lot of moving parts. So I hope that everybody will uh, will back it and enjoy it because I would really like to share this book with everybody. So, por favor. Oh, yeah. By the book. Poor favor. <laughs> <laughs> Poor favor. And grassy ass. <laughs> Support your local Puerto Rican. Support your local Puerto Rican. <laughs> Bill. There you go. Oh my goodness. Fantastic. You, oh, Thank you. you Thanks, folks. We, taco, taco. We, we had a ball. Thanks again. Burrito, burrito. Burrito. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us. I want to thank our guests because you are always fantastic. We love having you around and uh, we could talk for hours, but we've been going thank for you. an hour and 19 minutes. So yeah, long yeah. Uh, yes. Yeah, it, it happens. Like, it, get some sleep. I got, I got to go get some robot testing anyway, so I could draw. And, I think when dogs and add, it happens too. And add and then the trailer. Yes. Sounds oh, like don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Red Valkyrie. Go back the book, please. Sai, I'll leave it to you. Thank you. <laughs>
Shay had the wrong one. Thank you.